I've never seen him before. When are they going to come out with a uh, Waldo Go app where you can go around and try to find Waldo? Ah! I just gave somebody a million dollar idea. So Pokemon's going crazy. I'm going crazy because I have no social life. And my vlog won't upload. I've been trying to upload it since last night. So I decided since I went and I even have the phone set up right by the modem. So it's right there, getting all as much juice as possible. And it's failed. It gets to, and what the worst part about it is, is it gets to like 90% and then fails. Uh, it's, what time is it? It's afternoon already, and it's Saturday, and I really wanted to record time lapse of this painting, but I'm not gonna wait around all day for this video to upload so I can start painting. No way. So, I'm recording this little snip, sniplet, snap, sniplet, snipe, sni sniplet. Snip, sniglet, snippet, this little snippet, and then I'm going to try to upload again. So at least I'm recording it first uh, Saturday. Damn it. I finally got the video uploaded. I edited it. I put the description, the tags, made it public, and shared it. Nice. It's good to have not burned bridges in my career. I used to work at strip clubs. I've mentioned this many times. I no longer choose to do that, but I still, of course, have friends, guys who do like to visit gentlemen's clubs, strip clubs, see the girls, check out the tatas and the cheek cheeks and all that. So, I just soaked my charger in my paintbrush water. Damn it. We didn't ruin it. The only one I got. Anyway, um, had some friends that went out for a bachelor party last night and they went to one of the clubs that one of my buddies works at and he's a good guy no matter what. Man, he'll give you the shirt off his back good guy so I messaged him and he was able to help him out so um, I'm guessing that they probably still spent a lot of money but they probably would have spent a lot more had he not been there to help him out and I don't even know the details but he helped him out and they were uh, telling me to thank him today so thanks my buddy okay so while I was uh, waiting for that to upload I had to go ahead and paint so I was painting some more over here. I don't know if you can tell a difference or not because of uh, the glare. I hope that my video, my vlog from yesterday didn't offend anybody. One, it's just my opinion. Two, everybody has an opinion. You know what they say about opinions, right? And three, I don't think that How do I say this? Nothing I say is going to change anything. I try to stay non-political. I try to stay non-controversial. Um, it just doesn't suit my personality. I've never been that way. I have opinions on things and they're short and sweet. But this one in particular, is effect, effect, it affects everybody, you know? Just how the world has gone crazy. Nobody wants to get along. Everybody wants to be treated fairly, but they want to be abusive in the process of trying to get those equal fairnesses. Does that make sense? Sorry, I'm not the most articulate person in the world. But anyway, uh, it's just my opinion, and if I did offend anybody by saying that, you know, there's parts that I didn't even add, you know, I was, I went on about hate groups, and this and that, and, and I decided to not put that part in there, but, you know, 
I just hope that everything clears up and people start realizing that the one thing we all have in common is this earth and we need to work on saving it as well as preserving our way of life and our freedoms and the right to have opinions and all this and that. You know what I mean? Because someday it may not be that way. And if we continue to kill Mother Earth, Mother Gaia, then we're all gonna be living in hell. So, enough with the speech. Get off my soapbox. Let's paint. feel like painting gonna paint the night away until 10 o'clock I'm gonna paint till 10 man God didn't ever give nothing to the tin man that he didn't didn't already have and it's not God it's Oz Oz never did give nothing to the tin man You like that? Oh, the Tropic of Sir Galahad. Mm, man, those songs, they, those songs, if you come from that era where you grew up in the early 80s, late 70s, those songs heal you in a sense. To me, it does anyways. If I'm having a bad day and I can go put on America or, you know, songs of music like that, Steve Miller band, James Taylor, Oh man, Pure Perry League, stuff like that. Simon and Garfunkel, J. Uh, and go on and on. Those songs heal you. Sticks, Bruce Springsteen. I mean, uh, there's a uh, album set that I have. It's, it's, it's uh, it was uh, CDs, but I converted it to MP3s, and it was Time Life Music's. Rock of the 70s or Time Life Music 70s Greatest Hits or something like that. It's like 23 or 33 or something like that CDs. And my gosh. And it's, uh, I got from the 70s and from the 80s. And let me tell you, that's the best purchase I've ever made because those songs are healing. There's some sad ones, there's some fast ones, there's some happy ones, some goofy ones I mean it doesn't matter they're all there and they're all awesome and there's there's tons that aren't even on there that are amazing too you know I mean uh, I can't even begin but um, I guess it's all who who what uh, era you grew up in or whatever because when I hear people who grew up in the early 90s and, and late 80s and even late 90s early 2000s they have their songs maybe that do this for them but I don't know, because I'm not them. I'm just old. But I love it. I love having the experiences I've had in my life. So what's going on, everybody? It's Saturday night. It's Saturday night, and I ain't got nobody. And I just got paid. Something like that. Um, yeah, I should be out with my friends doing stuff. But uh, I'm not. It's nearly 10 o'clock right now, and my next appointment is with my bed to stop and play with the cats for a little while and then go to bed. I ate a slice of pizza earlier, and uh, that's about it. I've had two of these today. This is my second one. It's about halfway. 
Send me good vibes, people. Send me good vibes. Because you'll be seeing this tomorrow when I'm recording the next one. So, send me good vibes. Just good thoughts. Send me good thoughts. It'll get here. I promise you. I'll receive it. Okay. Good vibes, everybody. I'll talk at you later. I'm Max Dean. Thank you for watching the vlog. Thank uh, Tony and Brandon behind you here, behind me here. And uh, I'll talk at you tomorrow.